Today we're checking out SML movie Cody's Lawsuit. Let's dive right on in. Ugh, I hate school. Uh, me too, dude. Come on, guys. School's Cheer lame. Up. School's great. You get to be around your friends and learn new things. These are the best years of our lives. Jeffy hit him. Ow! Well, Good boy. Hopefully it runs you over. Yeah. Darn, it didn't hit you, Cody. Maybe next time, dude. Let's get on the bus. Ooh, look, a quarter. Hey, I got a quarter. Ow, ow, hey, my aunt's got the door. Open the door. Open the door. All right, is everyone on the bus? Uh, yeah, I don't think we're missing anybody. Bro. I think he's sick. All right, let's go to school. Open the door. Uh. You guys hear that screaming? You hear too? Oh, I always hear a voice in my head screaming, kill everybody. I thought it was just me. <laughs> what? That's just Joseph. What? Cody, what are you doing outside the bus? You're supposed to ride inside it. Cody, I tell him to stop the bus. Okay, I'll tell him to stop. Hey, stop the bus. I'm not stopping the bus. We got to go to school. You're dragging Cody. I'm not dragging anything. Go back to your seat. Uh. <laughs> oh. 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 Happy she doesn't have to cook tonight. Hold on, Crass. Let me go pick up my dinner. Is it cat? Is it dog? I hope it's, it's cat. Cody. Oh no, I am so fired. Man, kid, you're lucky to be alive. You get hit by a bus. Most people don't survive that, but you did, and I, I think that's just neat. That's crazy. Hey, Cody. Hey, dude. Mm, thanks for coming, guys. Ow! Never mind. It was a fly. I didn't want it to bite you. Yeah, that fly. Was killed really a fry. Happen. How you feeling, Cody? Oh, I feel just peachy, Junior. You know, I feel like I got run over by a bus. Oh, I know what you're talking about. When I have the flu, I feel just like that. Right? But I actually did get run over by a bus. We what know, a coincidence! Stop about it. Stop being dramatic. Yeah, you're making your whole identity. Ooh, I always think I got ran over by a bus. We know. Cause he did. Life sucks. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does, Junior. I got hit by a bus. What would you rather got hit by? A train or a bus? Ooh, tricky question. Well, I guess if I get hit by a train, I would have died, so I'll take the bus. <laughs> See, look, you Getting run by a train wouldn't be so bad this. if it was Cody. Yes, I said a bus or a train, you chose a bus. Uh, Junior, if I could move, I'd hit you. Cody, tell your friends to leave. It's time to insert your catheter. No, I want them to watch. What's a catheter? It's a needle that goes in your pee hole. Ew! Hell yeah, it is. And I want the man to do it. It's hot. Um... You know what? Actually, on Bro. second thought, you don't even need a catheter. You're you're ready to be discharged. You can go home now. I can't believe you were hit by that bus. You know, if you were to sue the school, you'd make a lot of money. What? what yeah, yeah, that's a good idea. I'm gonna sue this school. Ow, Junior, why? But there's a fly. The fry. What flies are there in this goddamn Killed his bus? Grandfather. You think you're gonna sue the school? Yes, I'm gonna sue the school because they own the school bus. Now I'm gonna sue them. Uh, okay, uh, do you want us to pick you up and take you home? Yes, yeah, just drag me home. All right. Ow, the fly. Ow, ow, ow. Uh, he flies. Come on, Let the fry. Ow. So, Cody, how much money are you going to sue the school for? Uh, I was thinking $5 million. $5 million? You're asking for a lot, dude. That's a lot of gravy. Yeah, well, my insides are mashed potatoes from where the bus ran me over. And besides, I need that money for my pain and suffering. And I didn't even get my catheter, so what's the point? Uh, I'm just happy to be alive. Poor no, Cody. Cody, let's play basketball. I bet you'll feel better after that. I can't. Why? Because I'll beat you, huh? huh? No. Go ahead and say it. No, he, it. he's it's got bandages. Full body cast and I can't move. Well, you guys, if you need me, I'm going to be on the basketball court dunking. I think you're just scared, Cody. Uh, Junior. Bro, he <laughs> can't play at all. Can you get it? Junior, I'm in a full body cast. But I have an ingrown toenail and it hurts. Junior. Okay, fine. I'll get it. Hello? Is Cody here? Yeah, his tracker isn't working. We put a tracker in his booty and it went offline a few hours ago. And we paid good money oh, for yeah. the tracker, so tell me where our son is. If he took that tracker out, I'm going to be one mad mama bear. You know what? I think it's pretty racist that they call black bears black bears because the color of their fur. And they call white bears polar bears. We should sign a petition to be called polar bears cracker barrels. I think there's a restaurant called that. <laughs> no, that's cracker barrel, baby. Oh. And that's pretty racist, too. I think we need a black barrel. Well, Cody's upstairs. Well, we're coming in. Yeah. Here's yeah. Cody. Oh my God, Cody, my baby, what happened to you? You better ain't got beat up by no girl. Cause if you did, I'm a. You got hit over by a bus. No, I got run over by a bus. Oh my God, Cody, I told you those cartoons were dangerous. That Miss Frizzle and her magic school bus are a bad influence. Why didn't you? Look oh come on, on. she watched the magic you know you're school to be like bus. Taking across the road. I did look both ways. I just got caught in the door of the bus, and then it dragged me around for a while before running me over. Excuses, excuses. Cody said he's going to sue the school for $5 million. He what now? Baby, I didn't know you gave birth to a cow. A cash cow. <laughs> 
Hey. She's a big fat cow, so obviously she'd give birth to a cow. Cody, we're going <laughs> to sue the school, and then we're going to take this to the news, and you're going to buy mommy some new cans. And I'm going to get unsnipped. You're going to have a little brother. <laughs> Come on, Cody. Let's go get Jeez. you the best lawyer. Sheesh. So I reviewed your case. So what do you think? What do I think? I'll tell you. You mind holding this for me for a second? Oh, uh, uh, yeah, sure. Thank you. I think it's going to be a slam dunk. Oh, you guys are about to get Oh, paid. yeah. I'm going to win no matter what. I could go into the courtroom with my wiener in my hand and I'd still win. Please do. You know what? I think I might. Oh, order, 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 order. Judge Pooby. I am the Honorable Judge Boober. And today we will be hearing the case of Cody Natchez versus the OIU Dumb Elementary School. Cody is suing the school for five Millie. million dollars for running him over with a school bus. Guilty, guilty, guilty. Plaintiff, proceed with your proceedings. Thank you, Your Honor. Ladies and gentlemen of the court, imagine this. Your son just got done eating breakfast and he waves goodbye. Bye, Mom. Bye, Dad. I'm on my way to school. He walks out the door and walks to the bus stop. He finally gets there, and he's waiting for the bus to arrive. And out of nowhere, BAM! He gets hit by a bus, and he's left on the side of the road to die. Look, he looks like a mummy, and he was left on the side of the road crying for his mummy. Bro. Ladies and gentlemen of the court, I'm done with my proceedings. Boo-hoo, boo-hoo. A very sad story indeed. Defendant, how do you defend your actions? Oh, it's my turn. Okay, man, don't worry. I'm going to win this case in my opening statement. Bro. Ladies and gentlemen of the court, my client... I didn't know Brooklyn Chinese. guy was also a lawyer. Yes, we'll show that. And being Chinese, he's, you know, unfamiliar with American traffic laws. But, you know, Chinese, Japanese, dirty knees, look at these. We're all human. We all make mistakes. You know, dirty knees. does make joke and pee pee in your coke. I think he still deserves a second chance at the American dream. I rest my case. Hmm, I see. Plaintiff, how do you respond? Guilty. We're not at that part yet. How do you respond to what he said? Oh. Well, yeah. here's a photograph of my client before he was hit by a bus. Just look at him. A normal, ugly looking child. And now look at him! A Even uglier. Nature, unrecognizable. Looking like that, he will never get married and he'll never have a job. But five million dollars will make him very rich because women love money. I'm gay. Men love money too. That's all I have to say. <laughs> yeah. I agree. We all love I'm money. gay. <laughs> Defendant. Defend. Oh yeah. Well, I can use pictures too. Uh, ladies and gentlemen of the court, can you see what this is? Oh, those are egg rolls. That's right. These are egg rolls, and this is what my client ate on the day he ran over the kid. Now, ladies and gentlemen, can you tell me what ingredients are in egg rolls? Hmm. Anybody? Well, neither can I. So how do we know that the ingredients of this egg roll did not cause my client to not realize that he was dragging a kid on his school bus for miles while he yelled for help and then run him over? Hmm? We don't know that. Which is why I think we should be investigating the egg roll company, huh? H how do we know the egg roll Bro. company doesn't have some kind of chemical C in Cody's there got that, this. that causes memory loss that could have caused this to happen? Hmm? Actually, my wife Ring Ring made the egg rolls from scratch. Okay, well, his wife made the egg rolls, but I think we should investigate his wife. H how do we know this wasn't intentional? Maybe she took out an insurance policy on him and was hoping he crashed his bus. Hmm, I think we should oh, do no. that. So suck it. Suck it, ladies and gentlemen. Hmm, very good points. Hmm. Plaintiff, continue with your plaintiffing. Your Honor, my client is suffering from irreversible physical and psychological damage. He is afraid of school buses. Something I like to call school busophobia. Allow me to school bus a right, just like we practiced. Ah! See? He screamed at the very top of his lungs at the sight of a school bus. Something that is supposed to carry him safely to and from school. How is my client supposed to get a quality education if he's afraid of school Exactly. Buses? That's my case, Your Honor. That is very troubling to see. That will be very hard to defend against defendant, but I dare you to try. Oh man, I am sweating bullets. I, uh, I yeah. didn't send out any other pictures, but uh, hey, can I borrow that picture of that bus? Thank you. 
Ladies and gentlemen, do you see this bus? This is not a picture of the bus that Bro. ran over the plaintiff. This is a stock photo of a bus. So why would he scream at a stock photo? He should only scream at a picture of the real bus. So I think he's faking it. I think he doesn't have any injuries. I, I mean, obviously he has oh, physical no. injuries, but I think he doesn't have any psychological injuries. I swear if the know, judge I actually falls for this. By a bus, and he didn't Come on, Pooby. Don't I, fall I mean, for died, it. But your Honor, I object on the grounds that the plaintiff is being a little bitch about this whole thing. He should just be happy <laughs> he's alive. I agree. He is lucky to be alive. Plaintiff, it is your tiff to plaint. Your Honor, I would like to call a witness. It's one of Cody's friends who was there that day and saw the whole thing. Junior, do you mind coming up here, please? What do oh, I do? Could you just comes... tell us everything that happened the day that Cody was hit by a bus? Yeah, so we were all getting on the bus. And Cody thought it would be cute to like ride under the bus and hang on to it like a monkey. Well, no, I didn't. I got stuck in the door. Well, look, all I saw is when I looked out the window, he was hanging onto the bus screaming, Wee, look at me. Well, no, I'm saying, help me stop the bus. Well, he talked about this for weeks before he did it. I object to my own witness. Get the hell out of here. Why didn't we even call him in here? I don't know. I thought he was my friend. Hmm. How incriminating. Hmm. Defendant. Do your thing. No, 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 H hold on. I want his witness. I want to talk to you. What's up? Well, you said he did all this on purpose? I mean, he had to. Why else would it be underneath Junior. the bus was moving? I mean, he had plenty of time to get on when we all got on. No, I was picking up a quarter I found on the ground and my arm got caught in the door. Aha! Uh -huh. He was bending over to pick up a quarter off the ground. This just shows that he was in it for the money all along. Who even bends over to pick up a quarter, huh? Who even uses quarters? They're worthless. This shows he was so desperate for money and that's why <laughs> He's asking for such an egregious amount. I also asked him would he rather get hit by a train or a bus, and he chose bus. Aha! He chose this. My client was simply doing what he was asked to do. Hmm, this is getting juicy. Exactly. I can't wait to hear your response. Your Honor, are you really going to believe this crap? No one really wants to be hit by a bus. Let's look at the facts here. My client was hit by a bus, and the driver was Chinese. I would like to call in one more witness to the case, the client's mother. Judy, do you mind coming up here, please? Oh, here comes okay, Judy. Hi. All right, listen to me. Focus. You are Cody Nutkiss's mother, correct? I think so. After he was born and they took him to the nursery, all the babies fell over and there was just a big pile of babies. And they said, take one and go home. So I did. But I'm pretty sure he's mine. Okay. Now, as Cody's mother, is this what you want? Legal guardian. To be brutally struck down in the street by a bus? Oh, no. I thought it would always be way cooler if he died in a plane crash. Then there'd be a whole news article about it. Bro. Not what the client's mother wanted. Ooh, that judge is really hot. Can I go home with you? <laughs> Movie. Granted. Yes, Daddy. <laughs> well, uh, Cody wins. <laughs> yes! Yes! Wow, they actually won the case by that. <laughs> I'm sorry, yeah. man. I tried. Oh, it's okay. You want to come back to my house? My wife's making egg rolls. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. You won your court case. You are the best lawyer ever. I know. Well, technically, my mom won the case because she slept with the judge. And she should. He's a very beautiful man. Well, the good news is the five million yeah, Poopy is sexy. my bank account. And after removing necessary court fees and my attorney fees, this is what you're left with. What, a quarter? Wait, we supposed to get millions! Well, let me break it down for you. So, my consultation fee is two million. So million. good when it gets my the money. retainer fee is one million dollars, and my court fees are another two million dollars. So that ate up your five million dollars. You should be lucky you're even getting this quarter. But I get hit by a bus! Well, you also got hit with court fees. Hey, do you mind holding this up for me again? Oh, uh, sure, hold on. Slam dunk. Swish. Oh! I thought it was a slam dunk, but it's a switch. Or a swish. All right, so the SML question is, what is the most pain you have ever felt? Probably when um, I fell off my bike and I uh, hurt my abdomen. That was, that was, that was painful as fuck.